Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be making a cute bunny bookmark. Hope you like it. I'm sorry I deleted the first clips by mistake, but what I did was shape a ball of clay into the body of the bunny, which I put in a glass candle holder so that it was easier for me to sculpt and turn the rabbit. Then I shaped the two legs and blended them to the sides of the body. As I blended the legs, I started giving the whole body general texture with the biggest dotting tool you usually find in a nail art dotting tool set, moving on to a smaller one and eventually a fine ended tool to achieve different kinds of texture in the hair. Next you want to add the tail, blend it and add texture to that as well. To make the pads for the paws I used Super Sculpey in beige, but you can use any other flesh tone polymer clay or you can even paint them on once baked. To give the rabbit some colour I used soft pastels. You can also paint it with acrylic paint once baked or you can leave it white. I made space for a card bookmark with a blade, then using the blunt side, tilting it back and forth to open up the space a bit more. If you have a thin metal ruler or similar, you can sculpt the bunny on it and then remove it once baked. Then bake for 20-30 minutes at 110 degrees Celsius. To make the simplest of bookmarks, I used card and floral paper from a wrapping paper book for the other side. Glaze your bunny with water-based varnish and let it dry completely. In the meantime, glue the pieces of paper together and decorate it any way you want. I use stamps to write on mine, but you can do it freehand too. Then glue the card to the bunny and let dry. And your cute bunny bookmark is complete. If you follow me on Instagram you may have noticed that my workboard has changed 
as I did not find it comfortable to work on a tile so I went back to glass and found this cute little one with a sleeping cat on it by Jin Designs. I would like to mention this and other things I've been trying out in maybe a monthly favourites video so let me know if you'd be interested in that. I really hope you liked this tutorial, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time bunny rabbits. Bye! Ciao ciao!